Hi there everybody, my name is Jonathan. Today what I'm going to show you how to do is change your login screen on your iMac or MacBook or any Apple Mac product. Now, here's the difference between a Windows and a Mac. Here's the Windows. Hey, you're trying to, you're trying to change this file. I'm not going to let you... I've got Windows file protection. No way you're getting past me. You're not going to change this file. That's how it works. You've got to do hacking to change it. Here's a Mac. Oh, I see you're trying to change this file. Well, okay, just enter your password to verify you really want to do this. Ta-da, done. So much nicer. I just love it. It's great. Anyways, first step, go to Macintosh hard drive. Second step, system. Third step, library. Fourth step, core services. After you're in core services, expand that window so you can see everything. And you're going to be looking for a file called default desktop okay whatever you do make sure you have a backup of the default desktop right click default desktop and select copy and paste it to your desktop and rename it default desktop copy and put it back in core services just make sure you have a copy it's going to be called default desktop and it's going to look like that ew it's space and great it's plain it's bland i want to change that okay icky so i've changed mine to this. Ooh, you can get this one off my website, www.jpfilms.site88.net. It's going to be in the description. Okay, so I'm going to change it to something else because that's already what it's called. So anyways, minimize core services. Go to Macintosh hard drive or whatever, your username, pictures, then find a picture you like. Ooh, this one's really pretty. Let's use this, okay? So what you're going to do then is copy that. Copy it to your desktop. Good. It's on my desktop. You can close out of that folder now of your photos. You'll see it down here. Ooh, pretty. La, la, la. Okay. You'll see it down there. It's going to be called whatever name. What you're going to do is single click it and call it capital D E F. A U L T, no space, capital D E S K T O P, default desktop dot JPEG. Okay, that's what it's going to be called. Then, what you're going to do, you're going to reopen that core services thing. Okay, it's open, and you're going to drag default desktop dot JPEG from your desktop into core services. It's going to say, oop, it look. It can't be moved because core services cannot be modified. Oop! I'll click the little button that says authenticate. It's going to say, oh, a new item named default desktop already exists in the location. Do you want to replace it with the older one you're moving? Replace. And it's going to say, oh, look, uh, you got to type your password. Type your password. I'm not going to reveal my password. Oh, look at that. Just like that, it's been changed. So now when you go here, you see default desktop. Click it. Oh, look at that. It's nice and pretty. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is, because the screen recorder doesn't work on the login screen, I'm going to take a picture and then tie that into the video. So thank you for watching. And uh, just like that, please be sure to check out my website. If you have comments, great. Have a good day because good days are always good. Bye.